So you see somebody walking out to an engine while you're still at the gate with tools. At this point, the captain is probably telling you we're going to start an engine at the gate. But let me explain what's actually happening on the ground. I'm sure you guys have seen this video floating around on the internet. Yep, that yours truly. Little old me. And what I'm doing there is called a manual engine start. Now you say to yourself, a manual engine start? What do you mean? You have like keys or something? No, that's not the way it works. Let me explain in detail of how these engines actually perform and function, especially with the components and why we have to perform a manual engine start. The engine starts with the air starter. It is a little unit that is attached to the gearbox. The air source needed for the starter comes from the APU, the auxiliary power unit. I made a big long video about this. If you guys haven't seen it, go check it out. I explain in full detail of what and why this thing exists and its functionality. Now back to the starter. Now before the starter actually gets air, it actually has a little valve before it. It's called the starter valve. Duh. <laughs> sequence of events has to occur for that valve to open now time to time that little valve does malfunction enter me with my 3 8 extension on the side of the engine there's a little port right there this is a cfm leap 1a i get access to the starter valve right there as i said earlier time to time the starter valve itself does malfunction but that does not make the aircraft unairworthy. It is placed on MEL, minimum equipment list, and as maintenance, we have to perform a manual start. Inserting a 3 8 drive extension, allowing the air from the APU to get to the starter to run the gearbox to start the engine. I must admit, this is probably one of the most exciting things to do. Standing next to your running engine, oh my goodness, the best. Let's listen to what it sounds like. Just want to remind you, all safety precautions are being taken. Once my coworker signals that the engine is fully started, I can walk away. That's about it, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. That's your manual engine start. Take care.